I'm Isaac Toops, Top Chef Season 13 finalist. Congratulations, Thank Isaac. Thank you. <laughs> now I'm ready to take on a new challenge. So I'm heading out to sea, where the food is delicious and the chefs are amongst the best in the world. Hopefully, I can pick up a few new skills along the way. Awesome! A fungo. Shouldn't be hard at all. This is Isaac Takes On, brought to you by Celebrity Cruises. I've always wanted to try my hand at bartending. And lucky for me, tonight, there's a silent disco where I'll be serving cocktails for 200. But there's a catch. The guy I'm going against, this guy. Shouldn't be hard at all. How you doing, Adrian? Yo, Isaac. How you doing, oh, man? They tell me you're a master mixologist. They also tell me you're a bar flare ninja. I'm serving 200 cocktails tonight. A, I need to learn how to make one. Yeah. And B, I want you to show me some of this flare. So, what would be the first move if I wanted to learn how to bar flare? What's the easy one? You can try this one. One single spin, just catch it by the neck. Perfect. Call Tom Cruise. After this one, one, yeah? Uh-huh. Try a double one back. Got it. Fuck. Oh, perfect. Oh, that's... Tie oh. me up. <laughs> but let's get down to the real guts and what, what the competition's all about, and that's yeah. making a cocktail. Now, as a master mixologist, yeah. what makes a really good cocktail? The balance between the sweetness, the sour, the bitter. Just like in cooking. Just like in cooking. Also, dilution. Dilution is a very important part of a cocktail, yeah? When you start making your cocktail, there's gonna be some water in it. Depends on how much you shake it, depends on the way you shake it, and always, always before handing out the cocktail, try it for yourself. Try a cocktail before yeah. you give it to somebody. I yeah. that's, that's a wonderful that, idea. So, balance, dilution, customer service. Yeah, you gotta put one. them smiles that's in that face. One. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. I'm done talking about cocktails. Yeah. Let's make one. One ounce of my favorite vodka. One ounce of my favorite liquor. Next, we're gonna go with a lemon juice. For balance. White cranberry juice. Got a punch to it. We're gonna double strain it. I do not like ice crystals in my drink. Oh, fuck. Just a splash. Ooh, Adrian, this is really good. You like it? You can drink about seven of these. It's super balanced. It's got a little bit of sweetness and that little bit of lemon right at the end. I've got a tough job ahead of me. Tell me what you call the cocktail. Blue happiness. Blue happiness. No, it's not happiness, it's happiness. happiness. Yeah, you even flare your hands. Yeah. All right, now I want to try my hand in making a cocktail. I make drinks all the time. They just have to be bourbon on the rocks. I want to make a cocktail that speaks to my taste, but I think the crowd will like too. Start with some aged rum, almond syrup, a little bit of sweetness, a little bit of orange liqueur, a little bit of lime juice for that balance we were talking about. I do like a little bit of the ice chunks. I am going to garnish with a little bit of mint. Before you put the mint, just give it a little bit of a slap. Oh, a oh, oh. Oh, oh. Try this. It's a variation of a Mai Tai. I call them Mai Toops. You know what I call them? Mai Toops? That's my last name. And I'm horrible at naming things. Oh, no, I don't. Oh, my God. This now is let's, really good. Now, let's see if I can make 200 of them. Oh, don't worry about that. This is nothing. Nothing for you. <laughs> All right, Adrian. We're going to serve 200 people. The audience is going to decide who wins and who has to swim home. It's a long swim. May the best mixologist win. Let me hear you scream! Walking into the silent disco is like walking into another world. I want to join in, but I got to stay focused on my cocktail. All right, man, you ready to do this? Yeah, of course, man. Good luck, man. Half ounce of this one. Perfect. I have more Blue happiness. Oh, yeah. That's... Flash the mint. Yeah. All right. Now we got to let everybody else decide. Who's the winner? Winner, winner. Who's... Chicken dinner. Now, really taste those cocktails, ladies and gentlemen. Which cocktail you think was the best? If you think the blue happiness was the better cocktail, Right over here on my right hand side. If you think the My Tops was the better cocktail, then you want to stay over there on that side. What do you say, madam? Do you like the blue happiness? Oh, it makes me very happy. You look very happy to I'm me. Very happy. <laughs> oh! What do you say, sir? Do you like Chef Isaac's signature cocktail? It's got some great complexity and depth to it. All right. Oh! That's all I got. A very, very close call now, ladies and gentlemen. A very close call. I'm just glad I'm being judged of the cocktail and not the flair. Oh! Ladies and gentlemen.
and gentlemen, the winner of the signature cocktail is nobody less than our very own Top Chef Isaac! I came, I saw, I my tide. Adrian taught me that just like cooking, creating the perfect cocktail is all about balance, but also having a little fun. If you can't have fun while you work, it's not worth it. I'm just really glad it wasn't the flair contest. Adrian would have had me whooped. <laughs>